some of us use our eyes to stare meaningfully out the window or to watch one another on the internet making word salad, but how much do we really know about this exquisite sensory system? Let's talk eye myths. Myth one, we see everything in our field of vision. Not so you have a blind spot, I have a blind spot, we all have a blind spot. The eye is actually lined with photoreceptor cells that detect light and then they shuttle off information to the optic nerve in the back of your eye, which is great, except that the optic nerve actually passes through part of the photoreceptors lining the inside of the eye. So this creates a small receptorless dead zone of information. So it's a little like going to a concert and having to shift around to see the stage. Now, thankfully, having two eyes taking in an immense amount of data allows the brain to fill in those gaps of what we're seeing. Myth two, only men are colorblind. While it's far more prevalent for guys with about 8% of the population not able to properly identify colors, a scant 1% of women are also colorblind. Now, colorblindness occurs when there's a problem with the color sensing granules or pigments in certain nerve cells of the eye. So if just one pigment is missing, you may have trouble telling the difference between, say, green and red. Myth three, you have full-size eyeballs at birth. It may seem that a googly-eyed baby is staring at you with gigantic eyeballs, but that could be because a newborn's eyeballs are anywhere from two-thirds to three-quarters of the fully grown adult size. So most of that eye growth occurs in the first year, and yes, an infant's eyes may be eerily large, but just imagine a newborn baby with full-sized eyes. Myth four, the more you wear prescription glasses or contacts, the more dependent you'll become on corrective lenses. Now, when you wear glasses or contacts, you're not changing the actual physiology of your eye. The myth probably came about because as you age, your eyes deteriorate and people tend to rely on stronger and stronger reading classes as they get older, and this creates a false link between the two. Also, the lens on your eye is the only part of your peepers that continues to grow significantly, and as you age, according to Dr. Kenneth Chang, a comprehensive optimist, it's harder for your eye to accommodate the thickening of the lens. Myth five, eating a bag of carrots will give you the vision of a jet fighter. Nope, carrots are chock full of vitamin A, and if a person is deprived of vitamin A for too long, the outer segments of the eye's photoreceptors begin to break down, and the normal chemical processes involved in vision no longer occur. So eating carrots or really any other fruit or vegetable with vitamin A will keep your eyes healthy, but it does not mean that you'll attain 2020 jet fighter vision. All right, uh, now you know those are the myths about eyes. How many of them did you buy into before this? And knowing that babies don't have full-size eyeballs at birth, does that make them less terrifying? Let us know in the comments below. And to keep the videos coming, make sure to subscribe.